Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. My name is Rashi Goyal and in this video we are going to solve dx square minus 5x minus 2 is equals to 0 and we have to find the value of x. So let's start with today's video solution. So it's look like in quadratic equation. So we are going to compare with standard form of quadratic equation that is ax square plus bx plus c is equals to 0 where the value of a is 3, the value of b is minus 5, the value of c is minus 2. So first we are going to find the discriminant with the help of the formula b square minus 4ac. So there are three conditions. If it is greater than 0, that means positive. So two real roots exist. And if it is less than 0, that means negative. So two complex solutions exist. And if it is equals to zero, that means only one real solution exists. So let's find out. So D is equals to B square minus 4 AC. The value of B is minus 5 square minus 4 times 3 times minus 2. So 25 minus minus is plus 4 times 3 is 12 times 2 24. 25 plus 24 is 20, 49 which is positive, greater than zero, that means two real roots exist. So let's find out the real roots. So method one, dx square minus 5x minus two is equals to zero. I'm going to use quantitative formula that is minus b plus minus b square minus 4ac by 2a. The value of b is minus five plus minus under root, we already find the value of b square minus 4ac, that is 49, by 2 times 3. So, it becomes 5 plus minus so 7 by 6. So, first is 5 plus 7 by 6. And 5 minus 7 by 6. 5 plus 7, 12 by 6, which is equals to 2. And this x2 is minus 2 by 6, that is minus 1 by 3. Now method 2. I am going to use middle term split method. We can write this negative 5x as negative 3x, negative 2x. So if I take 3x as common from first two terms, so x minus 1. And if minus 2 is common, minus 2 is common, then x plus 1. Then they give two different roots. So we cannot take in middle minus 3x and minus 2x. So we have to think differently. So 3x times 2x is 6x. So we can write it as 3x square minus 6x plus x minus 2 is equals to 0. Now from first two term, if I take 3x as common, x minus 2. And if 1 is common, x minus 2. Now, x minus 2 is common. So, 3x plus 1 is equals to 0. So, first, x minus 2 is equals to 0. So, x is equals to 2. And 3x plus 1 is equals to 0. So, 3x is equals to minus 1. x is equals to minus 1 by 3. I have clear and you find it useful. So please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for more upcoming videos.